Hi, this is a quick demo of Go OSC, an application to send and receive OSC data for mobile platforms. It's written in Qt, so it currently runs on Nokia Symbian phones and Migo. Um, and it has what you'd expect for, for normal OSC applications like buttons. I've got it right now connected to C-Sound. Uh, that's where the sound's coming from. Uh, this slider controls volume. And this XY controller uh, is controlling uh, a filter and the speed of the loop. This second button, I've got it uh, to show how the button also transmits XY coordinates. As you can see, buttons can latch or not. Uh, you've got also pages. In Simon, you've got uh, two pages. You've got four in Migo. So if I go to the other page, we can see uh, some of the other widgets. You see here a label widget, uh, very simple. And on top of it, there, it's, it's an image widget, which can load JPEG and uh, PNG files, and can load a separate image for the toggled state. And you can see that I've got it rigged up so that C sound starts transmitting data to these six sliders whenever the button's triggered. You can configure Go OSC by clicking on this button, and there you will be able to set the send and receive addresses. You can choose from any of the local available addresses, and you can also load and save presets. Go OSC also allows you to create the interfaces in the phone itself. So if you go to the editing modes by clicking here on the little gear, You'll first go to the red mode, which is to create and to configure. So let's create a new slider. In the red mode, you'll be able to move the widgets around. And if you click and hold, you'll go to the widget properties, where you'll be able to set the channel, uh, the ranges, the color, and uh, you can uh, control the widget by sensors and different um, information depending on the, on the widget type. If you go to the green mode, to the blue mode, you'll be able to resize the widget. And then you can go back to the normal, normal usage mode to use the widget. Because Go OSC uses QML, an interpreted language for GUIs, you can do a really interesting thing when you connect it to a computer. I've got C sound cute here, but this will work for PDE, Super Collider, uh, Max MSP. I've got a, a, an automatic slider creator there, and you'll see that they're connected both ways. If I move the interface here, the slider will move. And what's interesting is that, it's that I can also delete uh, from the device. I can also uh, select widgets there from the graphical interface, and I've got a little Python script set up that will send them. I just need to make sure the address is right, send them over and they will come up and they'll be already connected to the interface. Go OSC allows sending interfaces between devices. I've got here on my left the Amigo Harmaton device. So if I go to a widgets preferences and click on the bottom right corner, I'll be able to send the widget. It'll show up on the other device and it'll be connected between uh, both devices automatically. You can also send the whole page by entering the edit mode and tapping on hold and down at the bottom you'll be able to send the whole page to the other device. Thanks for watching.